I have asked the commanding general what more he needs to meet this mounting aggression, and we will meet his needs. It's 1966. As Sergeant Capers gets off the USS Boxer, he is joining 180,000 other U.S. personnel there to help a struggling South Vietnam stay independent. <laughs> Chinese and Viet Cong have been outnumbered nearly two to one. For Capers, his first assignment was as the master combat diver overseeing a group of men based in Nha Trang, a once beautiful harbor on the south central coast. Home to the famous Po Nagar Tower, it is a major harbor and a major target for Viet Cong saboteurs, hoping to disrupt supplies coming in from overseas. On May 2nd, under cover of darkness, Viet Cong divers attach at least one mine to the hull of the USNS car, killing five men and sinking it in 48 feet of water. And so they wanted my diving team to go down and check the ship explosives. Caper's job was to take his men to the broken ship and make sure it was safe for the Navy salvage teams to bring her back to the surface. They went down, they searched the bottom of the ship. The ship was almost a thousand feet long. To ensure the sinking of a ship the size of the USNS card, the Marines were convinced that there were more mines to find and it was Jim's job to find them. And then disaster struck. Both the Navy and the Army committed a major foobar. Just as Jim's team began searching the hull, a nearby Army vessel began dropping trash in the water, attracting a school of deadly tiger sharks. Just one of those classic case of the right hand not knowing what the left hand is doing. And when they dumped the garbage, the tiger sharks would show up, feeding. It was kind of scary. Never saw them like that. Tiger sharks are man-eaters. Growing as long as 15 feet, Jim was taking no chances. I saw him out there and figured this is not good because I'm in charge. I'm a dive master. I'm thinking if one of my guys drowned, it'll verify what people always thought. This black guy, this, this black guy, that. Lose me, but not my man. So I secured the dive, put everybody back in the dive boats, and got back aboard the ship. When they got to the surface, the team was welcomed back by a round of applause. They had seen the sharks and had been worried for capers and his men coming back safely. The few black sailors they had, they applauded when I come out of the water. They never saw such a sight either. Eventually, the USNS card was secured raised and served again. And Staff Sergeant Capers learned a valuable lesson. Never trust someone else for his men's safety. It was a, a test, a test of fortitude, a test of leadership. I was never so proud of my men when we got back. 